Miss Barbara from the Athens Clark County Library, and I'm here with another Georgia Children's Book Award nominee called Elsie's Bird. Elsie's Bird is by Jane Yolen and David Small. As a little girl in Boston, Elsie loved the sounds of the harbor. She loved the sounds of the city, and most of all, she loved the sounds of the birds. She knew all their names and could sing right along with them. Then her mama died and her papa became sad and restless. He decided to move to a faraway place called Nebraska and set out there to be a farmer. And so they left. But Elsie felt lost in the vast grasslands of Nebraska. She missed her home in Boston. She missed the sounds and the songs of the birds. Elsie felt she couldn't leave their new tiny sod house. She was afraid of the noiselessness of the grassland. Elsie did have a little bird to help her remember her home in Boston. It was her little canary called Timmy Toon. He sang with her during her long days alone in the sod house. One day, Timmy flew out of his cage and into the grass. Elsie forgot her fear and ran after him. She followed him down to a creek where he came and sat on her shoulder. Then Elsie heard it. She heard the sounds of the grass blowing in the wind. She heard the geese and the creaking of the sandhill cranes. Elsie was mesmerized and as she listened, she began to sing a new song, a song of the grasslands. Elsie's bird has been nominated for the Georgia Children's Book Award for the year 2013. Check it out from the Georgia Children's Book Award section of the athens Clark County Library. See you at the library.